Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Bug Fables, the Everlasting Sapling. In the last episode, we had gone into the Wasp Kingdom Hive, we found Queen, I think her name was Veronica? I don't remember, the, the Wasp Queen. Um, and we brought her back to uh, the Ant Kingdom, and the Wasp Ping ended up stealing all the artifacts. whoop de doo um, anyway, today we're going to be doing some side questing. Um, originally I was going to start the episode where we, where I was planning to go. Um, however, when I was here down in the, um, ant tunnels, I saw this guy, so I want to talk to him first. But also before I do that, um, I made a little bit of an oopsie. Um, so my stats items, uh, berry count might not be the same as it was last episode because Normally what I do when I do Let's Plays, I um, usually have two copies of the save file. So I'll play one and then after I finish editing the videos and making sure everything's good, I'll like copy that save onto another profile just so that way I have two copies of the save in case, um, you know, a recording fails and then I can like re-record that episode, right? Um, just because otherwise, you know, uh, with story-based games, you know, you can't, you can't like re rewind, you know what I'm saying? So I just do that as like a backup and I accidentally copied the old save over the recent save so I ended up having to redo the general Ultimax fight. Um, but otherwise it was pretty much the same stuff. I think I pretty much did everything I did in the last episode. Um, but I don't think I fought as many enemies, so I think I'm a little bit behind in levels. And I don't exactly remember if I did quite as much in the ways of, you know, like, item, like, items and badges and berries and all that stuff. So it might be a little bit different, but I tried my best to kind of stick with what we, um, had previously. Um, anyway, let's talk to this guy. Boy, Team Snake Mouth, during the attack, a piece of the main crystal fell off. We turned it into a pretty nifty tool for you. Would you mind testing it? The Ant Compass. Uh, this compass always points towards the Ant Kingdom. Use it quickly to find your way back. This compass always points to this big crystal. Use it whenever you want to travel back here. There's quite a few tunnels leading back here already. The compass will take you to them. Okay, that's cool. So I wonder if that means um, we'll be able to just fast travel here maybe that's like a that would be nice um anyway i will meet you back where i plan to go all right so we are back here um in the chomper caves or whatever so we're gonna be going through this again um since i already cleared this dungeon i'm not gonna show it again just because um you know i don't want to show this again because i've already been through it once um, I, because technically I died when I faced the boss of this dungeon, um, I don't have the badge we collected, so I'll probably just pop that in again just to show, and I'll probably do a little bit of fighting just to, um, get some EXP to get to the next level up, so I will see you guys in a moment when we're done with this. Alright, so we're at the end of the cave. I realized that there was a log to knock down here, so I knocked it down and I just saved so I can more easily get to a, um, retry if I accidentally goof this fight. So that's definitely good. Um, I re-equipped the medals and everything, so, um, this is sort of the goal, the thing that I'm going with. I took favorite one off of V and I put it onto Kabu because he's going to be in the lead, so he's probably going to be the one taking the most damage. Um, but then also, um, he can't block. And, I mean, I don't know if negative, I feel like negative defense doesn't actually increase the damage. It just makes it so that way, like, blocking cancels it out. Cause like I feel like when it, since I've had it on V and she's usually in the back with the B, with the back support, I'm not sure if it cancels it out or what, but I don't know. We're gonna try it, and he can't block anyway, so what difference does it make? Um, I took pretty much everything else off, um, and I put sleep resistance on uh, Kabu, especially because Kabu can't he can't block, so and I put it on um, uh, Leaf as well, and with Kabu being in the front. Um, I'm gonna put Kabu in the front, and then you'll see the strategy in just a moment. 
So let's try this again. Alright. <sighs> We're gonna try this. Kabu being in the front can take these guys out in one hit, which is very important. I'm gonna have V do the spying because Leaf um, deals bonus damage, I think, because it's a plant based enemy. Heep, I almost got eaten. This thing ain't messing around. She keeps spitting chompers out. I think I'm gonna beat her up first. So yeah, we pretty much wanna focus on the mom chomper with, uh, uh, with R2. So that's sort of the goal here. I guess it doesn't really matter who goes in the front, but, um, it does help. Although I do feel like Kabu took more damage there, so I don't really know. Um... And since Kabu can't really do much anyway, um, I don't think it would really matter all too much if we did Frozen Drill. Deals a <laughs> that did like half her health, oh my gosh. Um, and then I feel like it wouldn't... Yeah, I feel like this wouldn't make much of a difference. We just want to kind of... Want to try and do as much damage as we can. Ow! Okay, this is suddenly going very poorly. Um... He's frozen drill again. Oh my gosh. You know, can I just relay to Leaf, who can then do Frozen Drill again, and that would do him in? Yeah, that did it. <laughs> okay, I was not anticipating that to go so well. Thank you, Frozen Drill. You are you are my favorite seagull in the game now. That went way better than the first run. I feel kind of skimped on EXP, though. And I assume that's gonna be a badge. The Chomper Seed. Maybe a scientist would know what to do with this. Maybe that'll be a boss thing for HB or something. I don't know. I'm a little... Mm, I'm a little let down, not gonna lie. But, you know... <laughs> much better run than it was before. And that's all I wanted to really do for right now, so I don't know what else I'm supposed to do. I'm definitely not going to try the other boss, at least not yet, um, but I'm going to put my stuff back in order, um, just because, like, I don't want to keep my favorite one on V, I want Berserker. Okay, before we do anything, there's actually a thing of rocks right here. We have a burrowing spot, which gives us a lore book. Cool. Didn't notice that on the way out, but I saw that, so that's one thing to do. Can we burrow under this gate? We can, okay, that's is actually something interesting to do now. Okay, there's that. Well, maybe we'll go exploring. I'm gonna save first, because I don't know what, wait, what awaits us on the other side of that. Um, so, yeah, that'll be fun. I don't really know. We'll have to see. Oh, this is just more... desert? Have we already been to this part of the desert? Because wasn't that where the, um... Because that was knocked down, so yeah, that was where the, uh... We go up here, this will lead us to... 
We've been, we've been, we, I think, I feel like we've been here, because this is where the, um, like, right up there on that pedestal there, that was where that one badge that makes you, um, gives you more actions at the start of a battle, but makes your exhaustion go up faster. Okay. Well, that's kind of a letdown. Anyway, we can, there should, isn't there a, um, there should be a, a, a job board here, right? I'm pretty sure. Somewhere. I think it's, is it this? Yeah, here we go. Is there any, any quests here in, um... Yeah, sure. Is that... Utomu. Sarasil. Okay. Made it still some super silk, but we can take that because I'm pretty sure we found that in the thing. Sure, I'll take it. I don't remember having to do anything. Um. Uh, by the mayor. Okay. Yeah, we can do that. Um, because we already found that when we helped Tanji. Um, Ngira. When, where have we seen Ngira? Blast those heckin' wasps. They've stolen my prototype Mecha Claw. Use it for everything. How am I supposed to work now? Can you do it by hand? Says the clients. Of course not. Uh, Defiant Roots. Meet me on Metal Island here. Hmm, okay. Well... Um Yeah, we'll take that. We'll go we'll just go we'll just go to um We'll just go to Defiant Root, which I think I mean for eh, we'll take, yeah, I'll just take the, the ant tunnel so that way I don't have to accidentally fight anything. Also I saw that there was a thing. Um a new tunnel looks like to the far wildlands or to the grasslands. Um, so that'll be good, and I believe the first quest we had was here, right? Ah, it's too hot! Isn't there an ancient fan in here? Oh, no. You must be Arami. Ah, yep, that's me! How may we help you combat this heat spell? Leaf, freeze her up! Wow, what a nice breeze! Mission complete. Pay up! Wait, it's already hot again! I'm super thankful, but I, I need something that will last after you're gone. Hmm. Perhaps an umbrella, or some sort of ointment to shield you from the sun's rays? I'll take anything, really. Please, I'm begging you. So much for the easy check. Well, find something, so sit tight. Try not to, uh, work yourself up until then. Alright, well, that was a bit of a disappointment. Um... Expecting you to just be like, oh, just get me some water or something. Um, it's too hot. Ice or ointment would do, maybe even an umbrella. Um, do we have an umbrella? Yeah, well, well, we'll find out. We'll figure it out. Um, we just need to find the dancer lady now. The one who wants her silk. Ah, it must be you. I can't believe it. My baby. My handmade, extremely high-quality silk. That's gotta be Kali. Excuse us, miss. Whatever could you want? Can't you see I'm devastated? We're here to help! You need not suffer any longer. Could you tell us what happened? Ah, explorers, please excuse me. I've been very on edge. I have ample reason to believe my bandits have stolen my silk. Not any silk, yes. This one costs both time and many berries to manufacture. The bandits must have really done a number on Divine Root. Leave it to us. You'll be able to craft again soon. So dashing. Please return it before they ruin it. You got it. Start getting the reward ready. Ah, uh, we've kind of had it for a while. Ah, my baby! My hand made extremely high-quality silk! It did feel incredible carrying it back here. 
Miss Scully, did you truly create such an exquisite texture? That's right. Silk and the wondrous items of fashion and leisure can be woven into are my absolute passion. They've got to be worth a fortune. No wonder it got stolen. A fortune? Ha! <laughs> you cannot put a price on a masterpiece. Though I'll have you know my prices are very economical, darlings. This place is so cool, though. I've never seen this big wheel before. Wait, wait, do be very careful near that vase, my dear. It's a gift from a client very close to me. Incredible. Your work touches the hearts of the wet wearers strongly. Same, we're not too much into fashion. I'm itching to get back to work, so... Please, let me reward you for all you've done for this shop. You got a lore book. Okay. And you all seem absolutely exhausted, you poor things. Breathe this in, my darlings, and it should soothe and fix your wounds with ease. Oh, thank you so much. The smoke. <coughs> v, watch out. Achoo! Sorry, the smoke makes me really dizzy. <laughs> that face was one of a kind from... It shattered, ruined, obliterated. Oh, this is the worst day of my life. I... I'm sorry. Sorry is not enough. It's time you show the consequences of touching things that do not belong to you. <laughs> Stop it, I said I'm sorry. What's this smoke? <laughs> the leaf. Come hither, my dear beetle. What is going on my body? A surprise you can resist my charms, O oh blue one. I digress. Come, my knight. Let's give these two a proper thrashing. Kabu, what do you think you're doing? You're gonna betray us over this? I can't control my body. A puppet on silk and strings now. Let us begin, shall we? I'm sorry, what? Homegirl... Oh man, I can't even use frozen drill. You're in big trouble, Kabu. I'm super mad. But I don't want to hurt you. I need to think of another way. Okay, you know what? I'm sorry about the vase, but you're going too far. Give Kabu back. Maybe if I knock her around a bit, she'll stop dancing and start listening. Oh my god. Get rid of that. Um... She didn't have... I'm just gonna have to focus her down, I guess. Oh my god, you gotta stop, dude. This was not on my list of things to do. Okay, defense? Yeah, that's fine. I could ignore you for that. Um... Okay, cool. She's frozen. Okay, 
Okay, I, yeah, I keep keep buffing keep buffing our defense. Um Okay, taunted means you can't do anything but attack, which is fine. I was gonna attack her anyway. This is just a matter of with what. Um, I think if I do Frigid Coffin on her again, I should be able to kill her. Assuming I don't mess it up. Um... I'm just gonna do Hurricane Toss, because I can do that a lot easily, more easily, and I don't want to mess it up. Ah! I... I yield! Good. That was stupid. That was unnecessary. We could have replaced the vase. Extremely unnecessary. Please don't control my body. I'm sorry. That smoke smoke made me dizzy. I couldn't help it. Ah, <sighs> all right. I apologize as well, my dears. It was quite uncouth of me to lose my temper. Let's put this behind us, hmm? Water in the oasis, as it were. I'll see if Botumu can fix the vase. Fine with us. We're too lazy to press charges. I'll stay super far from the fixed one, promise. Despite the downward turn, we hope you make great things with that silk collie. Oh, I assure you, I can and will, my dear knight. Please remove yourselves from my shop, if you would be so kind. Okay, so I got a lore book and a boss fight out of that. Cool. Okay, well, 10 berries for an ice cube, so we'll take an ice cube, and then we'll give it to the girl. Because, I mean, like, hey, ice will make it, uh, will probably make it so that way you never lose your heat, right? Find something? Yes, yeah, magic ice. This is magic ice. It never melts. Wait, really? Then it might help after all, though I would have preferred an umbrella. I guess it doesn't matter, right? Sorry, it's not perfect, but it'll do. Yeah, you're right. Sorry, the heat's got me a bit cranky. I'll try it out. Ah, oh, much better. Thank you so much. No props. Now to seal the deal. Here, this should cover the item and more. Thanks. I'm gonna get going now. See you around. I wonder if... I, I, hope, I hope that completing the quest doesn't, um change the rewards, because that would be kind of stupid. I guess it does try to warn you a little bit, but whatever. Um, yeah, we'll leave the night. We'll leave the mare for later. I've, I've had enough of bug fables for right now, so anyway, that's going to be it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this content, leave a like, maybe consider subscribing, or leave a comment, or whatever feels good for you. And with that, I will see you guys in the next episode, where we probably continue on with a little bit of questing or something. I don't really know. As always, this is a blind let's play, so any tips, tricks, things you want me to check out, um, let me know in the comments below, but also try to keep spoilers to a minimum. Thank you and I will see you guys in the next episode. Mm -hmm.